we are here getting ready to change the turn signal on the F250 2002. When you turn left, it's sticking. It does not reset with the steering wheel. So we've got this new one here from 1A Auto. And I'm gonna try and video this for you guys. Tilt wheel handle comes off here. There's a little spot for a wrench. So, bottom star screw right there. Now we're reaching up into the top to get that star screw. We'll pull off those two connectors on the back and put the new one in. Got the old turn signal selector out. Here it is. And here's the new one about ready to go in. A couple things to point out on here. I ended up having to take off out the ignition which is really easy. I'll put a link to a video by 1A Auto about how to do that, just so that that top plastic cover could slide up a little bit further. I could get my fingers in there to pinch the little tab to release the plug on the back side here and on the top side there, so they pull out. So now what we're gonna do is just put this one in there, connect the two plugs, the little Torx screws go up top, down below, pull the shroud back down, put the ignition back in, put everything back up and everything should be working well. Connectors are in. Make sure everything's sitting good over here. Put the ignition back in. The way these come out is you Disconnect the batteries, turn the key to the on position, poke a little screwdriver with a flat tip up in that little hole right there, and then just pull the whole ignition assembly out. Same thing to put it back in. Keep the key in the on position, slide it in till this little ball catches in there, and then Pull, turn the key again. So we're going to make sure that ball is down, just like so. And then you slide it in, you see that ball popped out. Then you can turn the key back to the off position and take the key out. The bottom shroud is on, and now all that's left is to get this little guy threaded on here. All right, let's give her a test drive, see how she works. Everything works. We're in business. <laughs>